Hey everybody, how's it going? Jitter RJ here. Hope everybody's having a great day so far. Um, today we're checking out Jeff Dunham again. And for those who celebrate, this is 4th of July safety tips and a song from Jeff Dunham and the guys. Uh, before we get started, we're going to hit the like and subscribe buttons on the original video. That is the important part of what we do. Show support wherever we go. All of Jeff's links, as well as the link to the original video, will be in the description for those who want to go check that out. Uh, anyway, that being said, let's jump on into this and see what he's got in store for us. This should be good. Use safety tips in a song to make your July 4th memorable. Greetings, infidels! It is Ahmed, here to teach you the do's and don'ts of fireworks safety in honor of your American 4th of July holiday, where you celebrate the freedoms you have, which I despise, by blowing stuff up. <laughs> which I actually do like. <laughs> I am so conflicted. <laughs> Oh, no. Anyway, as you know, explosives can be very dangerous and fun. And no one knows this better than I do. <laughs> to help me, I have enlisted the very gullible, very drunk, and very stupid Baba Jay to help demonstrate what not to do. Are you ready, Baba Jay? Yeah. Uh, but wait, can someone hold my beer? <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> okay, let's review. Alcohol and fireworks do not mix, especially when your friends are evil and sober. <laughs> right? <laughs> oh, was that a do or don't? Score! A direct hit. <laughs> you sank my battleship. And there you have it, infidels. Be safe this... <laughs> I like that he's got Ahmed doing the fireworks. Explosions are his thing, you know. Uh, <laughs> poor Bubba Jay. <laughs> that last one was just like overkill when it hit him in the head. <laughs> and there... You have it, infidels. Be safe this 4th of July as you celebrate your infidel holiday. Drink responsibly and do not explode yourselves or you kill you. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> See how I did that? I like that. See what I did there? And now a very important public safety message from the Clydesville County Police Department. Oh, no. Hello, my name is Bubba J. I am in front of you today to help complete my community service by doing this pubic service announcement. <laughs> oh, oh, right, sorry. This public pubic service. <laughs> What's that? Anyway, I'm here to do the public. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> the pubic service announcement. <laughs> I love it. I love Bubba J. Him and Walter are my two favorites, I think. Service. No, you can't say that. What's that? Anyway, I'm here to do the public service announcement thing on how to drink safely during the July 4th holiday celebrations. Personally, I think after a pandemic, we have more important issues to deal with in this world. Hashtag free Britney. You know, he's got a point. If I was a drinking man, uh, like the song says, if I was a drinker, I'd be drunk tonight. Um, if I was a drinker, I'd be drinking on, on this holiday. Uh, just because it's a holiday. Um, even when I did drink, I only drank every once in a while. But I still get what he's talking about. It, it, it's after the last, after that fiasco that was a pandemic. Uh, yeah, everyone just deserves a round, you know, <laughs> or two or three. Anyway, 
more important issues to deal with in this world. Hashtag free Britney. <laughs> So why am I doing a safety Pretty video Britney. on drinking? <laughs> because I care. And also because it was part of a plea deal to reduce my sentence for public intoxication slash indecent <laughs> exposure. I would again like to apologize to all those folks who were in that Arby's that day, especially the church group. Sorry oh, for Lord. being naked and yelling, Arby's ain't the only one who has the meat. By the way, I wasn't totally... <laughs> <laughs> that is her slogan, Barbies. We have the meat. <laughs> oh, God. Barbies ain't the only one who has the meat. By the way, I wasn't totally naked. I still had on my mask, but I digest. <laughs> oh, hang on. Digest? Digress. Naked, I still had on my mask, but I digest. I Ooh, hang on, before I start, for promotional reasons, I have to say that today's video is brought to you by the new big screen teleprompter for guys with bad eyes or really old grandpa like guys. It's the Joe Pro 2020. <laughs> 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 12 easy payments of only $19.99. <laughs> the Joe Pro 2020. <laughs> Gotta love it. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Whenever you have to say something important and you can't think it up yourself, it even has a doodad built in to go in your ear so you can be told your ad libs. Or in case you skip a line and your handlers panic. Right. <laughs> Ooh, whoa, these words are really big. It's almost like I should be yelling. <laughs> <laughs> Here are now my safety tips to all those who consume an adult beverage during the summer, <laughs> especially during the July 4th holiday. Okay. Number one. I actually have to go number one. <laughs> okay. uh, limit your alcohol intake, especially on a hot day, as it will lead to dehydration, heat stress, or even sun stroking. Okay. All of which... S sun stroking? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> the dehydration, heat stress, or even sun stroking, <laughs> all of which I survived. But if you do, make sure you have a cooler and stick your head in it. <laughs> or you can drink on a neighbor's lawn who has a sprinkler going. <laughs> you know, <laughs> just thought I'd add that. No? Uh, all right. No. <laughs> oh, darn. I went off topic and lost count. Which one are we on now? Two. Oh, right. Now Lost I'm going count. to do number two. No. Well, I, I mean, never mind. <laughs> number two, do not mix different alcohols because it might increase your chance of getting sick and whirling. That's why I don't mix mm -hmm. alcohol with soda or juice. I just stick to alcoholic only. Good tip there on the Joe Pro 2020. <laughs> number three, try drinking non-alcoholic beer. Hey, they're not that bad, especially if you pour a little vodka in it. <laughs> Mr. Director Guy, wait, why are you shaking your head? It's kind of defeating the purpose of the non-alcoholic beer. <laughs> it's not that bad, especially if you, pour, if you pour some vodka in it. Or bourbon. Or tequila. <laughs> Pour a little vodka in it. Tequila was my <laughs> Mr. drink. Mr. Director Guy, wait, why are you shaking your head? I don't know. <laughs> Number four, think before you drink. <laughs> Who wrote that? I think that was the comic relief tip. That's a funny one. <laughs> hey, can we take a little beer break now? Oh, oh, what? Oh, the director is making motions. Motions like conniption fit like he's stressed out dude calm down have some jack <laughs> number five do not drink while lighting your own fireworks do it while lighting someone else's oh so sorry no just don't do it it can lead to mistakes just ask my friend fingerless frank 
or my other buddy One-Eyed Wade, or my oh. other buddy Burned Beyond Recognition Ralph, or <laughs> Sin Scrotum Scott, or... What? Uh, Did he just say Sin Scrotum Scott? No. Frank, or my other buddy One-Eyed Wade, or my other buddy Burned Beyond Recognition Ralph, or Sin Scrotum Scott, he did. or... Uh, Number six, don't swim <laughs> drunk, also known as don't drink and dive, unless someone <laughs> says you won't, right. and you say who won't, and then they say you won't, and then you say hold my beer, and then you're kind of <laughs> obligated to jump off your trailer home and into the above ground pool head first, but leave. <laughs> hold my beer. <laughs> Famous last words. <laughs> Jump off your trailer home into the above ground pool head first. That's a good idea. That leads to uh, being a few IQ points shorter. <laughs> I've, unless someone says oh, you won't gosh. and you say who won't and then they say you won't and then you say hold my beer <laughs> and then you're kind of obligated to jump off your trailer home and into the above ground pool head first. But leave that to us professionals. <laughs> <laughs> this is going great. Okay. <laughs> Do not place your unopened beer on the grill. Learned that the hard way. I still have aluminum shrapnel in my butt from that one. Not to mention it was a wasted beer. Number eight, do not pass out from drinking in the sun. You will wake up rather than a baboon's backside and it'll be the most painful ride to the burn unit ever. Speaking of which, don't sunbathe nude and pass out or you'll be taking a trip to the burn unit for your burned unit. Just saying. <laughs> hey, my court appointed officer just left. Is he okay? Did, did he quit? I think he did. <sighs> <laughs> and finally, when drinking, be very careful operating heavy machinery, like my new homemade margarita blender with a lawnmower engine. Let me show you. <laughs> hey, do uh -huh. a star wipe now. Lawnmower engine. Introducing the Bubbinator 8000. And We're going to have 500 fire-breathing horsepowered margaritas for Cinco de Gelayo. Gentlemen, I'm going to start my engine. Mm. Oh, yeah, listen to that power. <laughs> to make a proper margarita. Wait, can you hear me? That was fun. <laughs> Drinking can be dangerous, says who? Well, stay safe, drink responsibly, and have a happy 4th of July. <laughs> Will help here? You see why I love him? <laughs> and see why I said poor Bubba <laughs> before this part of the sketch? Uh, yeah, he is, yeah, he, I know a few people like him. Uh, actually, I've worked with a few people like him. Uh, they are fun to mess with. <laughs> That's for sure. Anyway. Responsibly and have a happy... Like he said, stay safe this 4th of July. We want you coming back, not going away. You know what I mean? Be 4th of July. <laughs> well, help here. My pants are gone. <laughs> you've only been here two days and you've already been hit by a truck, gotten blown up, rolled down a hill in a fiery dumpster. And I've tried curly fries. <laughs> so how do you like our country? Well, I'm in America, so I won't tell you how I feel. I will sing, just like those 30-year-old teenagers on that bafflingly beloved TV show, Glee. I love to hate watch it. When I was merely four years old, there was nothing I thought greater than to turn this nation you call home into a giant smoking crater. <laughs> but like Miley yeah. Cyrus and her bong, or Brett Favre texting all night long, or Mitt Romney's awful sing-along. Jimmy crack corn and I don't care. I was wrong, I was wrong, I was wrong. I was wrong. Yes, I was wrong. Obama phone. And so unconscious and have dead did you say Obama phone? <laughs> okay. I, I wasn't expecting the, sing, the 
song to be in cartoon form. As it threw me off for a second there, I got I got kind of stuck. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> anyway. Oh, uh, and I don't care. I was wrong. I was wrong. I was wrong. I was wrong. Yes, I was wrong. Obama phone. And so Obama unconscious phone. and half dead, I wrote this it song. Was this you folks are quite easily suckered, but your hearts where it belongs. I don't know why I can't deny that I was wrong. Running water, girls gone wild. No bomb <laughs> strapped to any child. Oh. I find I am beguiled. America! Yeah, what do you say? So much food you throw away! So much TV filled with gay! I love you, Project Runway, so I cancel my fatwa! Cause I was wrong! Oh, he was wrong! Yes, I was wrong! So very wrong! About America, I say that I was wrong, wrong, wrong! When I look across your faces, be they Wilsonburg or Chong, I must admit I am a twitter. Oh, I caught that. He X'd out the Berg. Um. Yeah. Not going to touch on that one. That's, that's a little anti-Semitic um, on that part. But then it is Ahmed, so. <laughs> when I look across your faces, be they Wilsonburg or Chong, I must admit I am a twit and I was wrong. Oh, I'll miss my friend the sniper and my flea-infested cave. I'll sort of miss my second chance to have an early grave. But even though you're filled with sin, like blindside you all took me in, a foreigner who has no skin. I like that, like blindside you took me in. That was a good movie, The Blindside, with, uh, oh, what's her name? You gotta be kidding me. She played in Speed with Keanu Reeves. I know the name. I just it'll get it'll come to me in a few minutes. Uh, but damn it, I can picture her because <laughs> she played Miss Congeniality as well. Uh, Sandra Bullock. That's who it is. I knew I'd think of it. It just takes me a few minutes sometimes. Uh, my memory gets worse and worse every day. I think. Anyway, I, I that, like as I was saying, The Blind Side. Great movie. If you haven't seen it, it's well worth a watch. Took me in, a foreigner who has no skin. Ah. Get away from him, he's mine! I was wrong, I was wrong, I was wrong! Yes, you're dim and rather simple, and you shouldn't wear a phone! But it's clear I shall stay here, for I was wrong, wrong, wrong. Yes, it is clear I shall stay here. You can do it just as once. And let it go! <laughs> this was good. Oh my goodness. This was really good. He has, uh... Yeah, that one up there, election 2024, that thing is like an hour and a half, hour and 45 minutes long. I had almost thought about doing that one. It's a, it says election 2024, how did we get here again? <laughs> So that's why I almost thought about doing it, but that is way too long. I might I might do it and break it up. We'll see. Anyway, I would love to hear you guys' thoughts on this one. This, this was hilarious. Uh, <laughs> but then again, it's Jeff Dunham. It's always hilarious. Um, he comes up with the craziest stuff, especially with Bubba J. <laughs> Poor guy. But I expected to see more than just Bubba J and Ahmed. I expected to see Walter and Peanut. Because they're on the uh, front of it, too. At least I thought they were. Anyway, like I said, I'd love to hear your thoughts on this. Let me know what else I need to look for, and I'll get there as soon as I can. Uh, that's going to just about do it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this with me. I hope to see you on the next one. I love you guys. Peace. Hey guys, make sure to check out one of my other videos right here at Jerry J.